in the name of Allah, the most gracious and the most merciful. Assalamu alaikum to all. Welcome to Virtual Learning System of Pakistan International School Time. Dear students, I hope you all are fine. Today we are going to start lesson number one in English B, noun, proper, common and collective noun. I hope you remember the definition of noun. What is a noun? Here you see what are nouns? Nouns are words that names a person, place, things, or an idea. Nouns are words that names a person, place, things or an idea. The word noun comes from the Latin words nomen, which means name. The word noun comes from the Latin word nomen, that means name. Noun is the naming word. Noun are the name of person, place, animals, things or an idea. Here you see the types of noun, common and proper noun. First of all, we read about this one, common and proper noun. A noun is a word that names a person, place, thing or idea. This is the definition of noun. A noun is a word that names a person, place, things or an idea. Common noun, a common noun names any person, place, thing or idea. Common nouns are not capitalized unless they come at the beginning of a sentence. For example, teacher, baseball, city. All these nouns are common noun. Keep remember, a common nouns are not right with the capital letter, are not capitalized unless they come at the beginning of a sentence. I hope you understand the definition of noun and plus common noun. If anyone asks you what is a noun, you must be remember that a noun is a word that names a person, place, things or an idea. And common noun names any person, place, things, or an idea. But common nouns are not capitalized unless they come at the beginning of a sentence. Here you see the pictures of common noun. See common nouns, car, boat, love, mother, dog, door, house desk so all these words all these pictures show the common nouns these are the pictures of common nouns house car dog door boat love desk mother these are the common nouns again here you see nouns for example, a person is a common noun, baby, place, city, idea, freedom, animal, puppy, thing, flower. Again, here you see a noun is a word that names a person, place, thing, an idea. Now, I hope you understand. Here again, here you see. Just everything that we see, touch, smell, taste, make, and even think are nouns. Like car, water, pencil, beans, work, capitalism, psychology, phone, light, etc. So just everything that we see, touch, smell, taste, make, and even think are nouns. Two types of nouns, common nouns, 
name any person, place, or thing like student, pool, pencil. And common nouns, non specific names. Keep remember common nouns, non specific names of a person, place, thing, and idea. So I hope we, in detail we discuss noun and common noun. I hope you understand. Two types of noun, common noun and proper nouns. Name of a particular person, thing or place. And it begins with capital letter like Barack Obama, Burj Al Arb Hotel and Sir Francis, track, statue. So all these particular names of particular person, name of particular place or name of particular things. And it always begins with the capital letter. Keep remember the definition of proper noun. You know that nouns have two types, common nouns and proper nouns. Common nouns, you knew. Now here the proper nouns, names of a particular person, place, things. And it begins with the capital letter. Again, here you see proper nouns. A noun that names a specific person, specific place, specific thing and a specific idea. Like here you see this is the idea of Newton theory of gravity. Yellow cap pizza. This is a special thing, a specific thing. Sir uh, uh, Peter and Paul Parrish is a specific place and the specific person Timmy. So proper nouns are nouns that names a specific person, specific place, a specific thing, a specific idea. Specific idea, specific thing, specific place, and a specific person. It is called proper noun. Collective noun. Another type is collective noun. Name a group of people or thing. This class of nouns denotes a group of people, animals, objects or concept or idea as a single entity like army, true. So when we use only one word to show the lot of people, like if I say 4B, it means all the students of class 4B include in just one word 4B. So when we use these type of words, these are the collective noun. Here you see army, in army lot of soldiers. So when we use only one name of group. We uh, just use the name for the group of people or thing. This class of nouns denote a group of people, animals, objects, or concept or idea as a single entity. Let's discuss more. Collective nouns is a word that names a group like faculty, committee, team. In teams, a lot of uh, students, a lot of people are there, so we just use the one word for the lot of people. So this is called collective noun. Collective nouns names a group of people or thing, like here you see family, herd, class, true, club, etc. So these type of words are called collective noun. Here you see the example of collective nouns, a flock of sheep. So here the word flock is a collective noun and sheep is common noun. A set of tools, set is a collective noun, tools is a common noun. A crowd of people, crowd is a collective noun, people is common noun. A fleet of ships, fleet is a collective noun and ships is a common noun. I hope you understand this example. Flock, set, crowd, fleet. All these words called collective noun. Collective nouns name a group of individual or things like family, team, crowd, club, herd, class. See family committee, class, herd, crowd, team, club, or audience.
So here you see identify the kinds of nouns in this sentence. You have a sentence, everyone in Mrs. Guzman's car was late for school on Monday. So here you identify the which, type, which kinds of nouns are present. Everyone we use for, we use as a collective noun. Everyone is a collective noun. Mrs. Guzman is a proper noun. Car is a car in school is a common noun. And Monday is also proper noun. Here you see Mrs. Guzman start with the capital letter. So that's why it's a proper noun and it's, just, uh, it's a name of a specific person. Monday start with the capital letter. It's the name of a specific day of week. And everyone. This is the, this type of words we use for the collective noun. Everyone is all. They just use the one word for the lot of people. School and car is a simple and it's a non-specific thing, specific place. So here you write this. this these are the common noun. Again, we revise here. You see the definition of noun. A noun is a word that names a person, place, thing, or an idea. Dear students, you must be understand properly because in the next lecture, inshallah, we will do the exercises. If you understand, then you do the exercises. A noun is a word that names a person, place, things, or idea. Definition of common noun. A common noun names any person, place, thing, or an idea. It's a non-specific name of person, place, thing, or an idea. Common noun are not capitalized unless they come at the beginning of a sentence, like teacher, baseball, city. Here you see the example of common nouns like house, car, door, boat, love, desk, mother, dog. So all these things, these words used as a common noun. Again, here you see a person, baby, idea, freedom, place, city, thing, flower, animal, puppy. A noun is a word that names a person, place, thing, or an idea. It's called noun. Here you see everything that we see, touch, smell, taste, make, and even think are noun. Keep remember. Two types of nouns, common, name any person, and non-specific person, place or thing, like student, pool, pencil. Common nouns, non-specific name of a person, place, thing, or an idea. Two types of noun, um, second one is proper, names of a particular person, place, thing, or an idea. Like it, and it always begins with the capital letter. Here you see proper nouns, a noun that names a specific person, place, thing, or an idea. It is called proper noun. Collective noun names a group of people or thing. This class of nouns denotes a group of people, animals, objects, or concept or idea as a single entity. Like if we use the word faculty, committee, team, so these type of words it means they include a lot of people are in team, a lot of people are in committee. So we just uh, use the one word for the whole team, for the whole, for the lot of people that is called collective noun. Again, here you see collective nouns, names a group of people or things like family, herd, class, troops, club, etc. I hope you understand nouns, common noun and proper noun. Here you see the word everyone is a collective noun. I told you before, the word car is a common noun. The word school is a common noun. Monday is a proper noun. Dear students, I hope you understand. Now here I share the one song about nouns. I hope you enjoy it and it's, it help you to understand clearly. Everybody's a 
chapter and inshallah in the next lecture we will do the exercises but you must be revise all these definitions properly okay okay dear students best of luck